Dozens of Wai'anae Coast teens are taking a stand against animal cruelty. KITV Force Paul Drews details their effort to change the way a community cares for pets. These teens are full of enthusiasm, and now they're directing that energy into an effort to make their West Oahu community a better place for pets. This is the main part that we see a lot of animal cruelty. Some of these teens have seen firsthand what can happen to animals that are neglected or abused. We saw a lot of people, they actually had animals tied up and stuff. So we go to door to door, you know, give education things, you know, tell them, you know, this is not the right thing to do. These Waianae Coast teens also formed an advisory panel to get more teens involved as advocates for animals. <coughs> they turn out not only to be effective at attracting attention, but also getting adults to change bad behaviors. Sometimes when we talk directly, we try to educate adults. They're not as receptive as hearing it from their children. A lot of times we learn best from our children. And the message these teens want to get out is a very personal one that animals are an important part of the family and should be treated that way. I love them. They're caring. When I'm upset, I call to them, I talk to them. I cry to them. It's like family to me. And these young activists are showing their love as this highly visible service project begins. The Waianae Coast is just one of four areas these teens will be targeting with their animal-friendly message over the next two years. In Nanakuli, Paul Drews, KITV4 News.